all and mm -hmm. you know that's it so you're not going to give us any ideas to some of the songs well i mean it's like it? well some of it, I, all i can say is that it, it deals with a really heavy topic you know it, it's really the whole thing is about life basically life on the streets okay you know in the 90s now all right. nowadays and it just deals with this one particular character who goes through these certain things in his life and it's just like a life story type life experience and i mean some of the stuff is very intense i okay. mean it's very it's, it would be it would take me too long to explain right. it to you but and the whole thing will have a prelude story that you can read before that you listen to the to the cd that would give you an idea and it gives yeah. you an idea of what the whole story is about and that that makes the songs better you know you can like catch what we're trying to say and so you you're also and the, you know, working on the choreograph, how you want to relate to the song right. Victoria and exactly. all different things. You know, we have four videos scheduled for it, so it's it's going to be, you know, it's like the first rock opera that um, any band has done for a long time. I mean, none of these bands have done have been doing that type of thing. You know, I mean, uh, Queensrÿche did something similar on Operation Mindcrime, but this is like more of a step forward even than that because it's double the length and the story's more involved mm -hmm. even though their album the way they did it was great but mm -hmm. it's like we're going to try and get a little bit more intense i'm really excited about that and i you know i really appreciate you you know coming on the show oh no problem um let's talk about the um, last video that we're going to see oh uh, this is for uh when the crowds are gone okay, which is, is a song that has to do with the new record that we're doing mm -hmm. it's sort of like the prelude of the new album that we're doing. Uh -huh. It's our newest video, and it's very nice. <laughs> so the video is self-explanatory as yeah, well? Yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory. I mean, it's just, you know, the song has a really deep meaning. You know, it's really, it's about a guy who was once a big star, very happy, very successful, and he realizes that he's now has reached, you know, old age, and he can't perform anymore, and he right. just wants, he's just reflecting on how he would like to go you know, Peacefully. back, and this song that he wrote for himself is his Requiem, mm -hmm. you know, and that's what the whole song is, is his funeral song mm -hmm. that he wrote to be played at his funeral, and he reflects on his life. It's pretty deep. Well, before we get to the video, I want to say that I know <clears throat> around, what is it, 24th of November? Right, we'll be... Local. You're going to be playing somewhere in a major, you know, area. Right. So, um... Right around here somewhere. Just yes, I'm going to look forward open. to it, and, uh... You're going to give us an exclusive and go out there and film it. Absolutely. And we'll uh, probably show it in January or something. Great. Right? Well, John, I appreciate you uh, being on the show Thanks with us. Thanks for having me. And appreciate take it. Take it easy. You, you know, too. Thank you for coming on the show. Don't get too time. wild now, Bill. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to go with you tonight, man. I'm going to learn how to be as wild as you are. There you, know? you go. All right. So let's get into the next video. All right. When the crowds are gone. All right.